Welcome to my little slice of heaven. Other videos on my channel will show you how much work I've done. But today is about one specific thing. Now, to preface this, I have done about seven, maybe eight hours total of work over the last uh, four days. We've got that pile, that pile, that pile. There was a tree right there that was bigger than, uh, about the same size as that one. That one right there, there were a couple of those right here. So this tree was, was about, this tree was the size of that one right there. This tree was the biggest one, um, super duper thick boy. And um, we cut all of this down with a $50 Portland um, <clears throat> electric saw from Harbor Freight. Now, oh fuck, that thing's covered in sap. Ugh, delicious. Um, the fire's going so I can, um, so I can burn pine needles. Um, it's actually kind of warm here. It's about 75 degrees right now. And as you can tell, the sun is going down. So I just wanted to kind of uh, make a quick video about this little thing. Um, this thing has been absolutely killer. Um, I had one previously that I had to return to get this one, um, which had a modified um, drive on it. So the gear that connects the chain and spins it. <laughs> Mosquito on me. Um, the gear that connects to the chain and spins it had a washer on it and um, if the chain got loose, it would wiggle back and forth, bend the washer. Um, I hammered it straight and got it right um, the first time, but then the second time it bent it, um, I just couldn't get it back to straight and reliable. So um, took it back, they switched it out. This one has a modified um, drive where it's a cast uh, steel sprocket with the, with the holder um, like just cast into the, so it's no longer an issue. Now, I wanna say this thing has put in an absolute butt ton of work. We did that bush, which was way, way bigger than that bush right there. We did this tree right here. The ax is just there for, um, I was using it for a hammer. Um, we did this tree, we did this tree. This one, I mean, you can see how long um, it is. And it's been very, very consistent. Um, after this much work, probably sharpen it I got the sharpener for it as well um, the only reason I'm not continuing and gonna do this tree and this tree today is because the Sun is going down and um, I've got neighbors on you know all sides but this thing really 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 puts in the work um, there are better chainsaws out there I've seen or I've used better chainsaws. I'm not by any means a chainsaw expert, but this thing is killer. Um, if they raise the price to 85 bucks, I don't think I would go, um, I don't think I would go another direction. Maybe go for a Craftsman because it's a comparable price point at, at that point and it can use the batteries for my other tools. But either way, um, this thing's put in a killer amount of work. This pile right here, I can't, like it doesn't look very big on on video but we've probably fared about like that's yeah we've fared a pretty good amount of trees i'd say we've got 1500 or 2000 pounds of debris here so um yeah it's uh super super great you can see how many how much actual tree trunk i've chopped through all the branches i've chopped off of that super duper killer um yeah, I don't know. No sense in this going over four minutes, but if you like my content, please subscribe. Um, I really do appreciate it, and it helps me um, help you.